Hey, what's up, gamers? Enforcer 5150 here, and yeah, we have more crash fixes like we have done with every other game, and all games do have these issues. Now, this is, happens on both, you know, your uh, Steam version and the Xbox Game Pass version, so it's not just, you know, specific to one or the other. Um, there are crashes that's been happening on... Uh, Xbox uh, consoles but unfortunately I really don't have any fixes for that that's going to have to wait for any updates that they actually put out through there but on Game Pass and on here uh, and on um, Steam we can uh, at least try to do a few things now there is one there's one major uh, issue one where you completely crash like it completely shuts down your computer like to the bone uh there's also the access errors that you are getting hopefully some of these uh fixes will help you with that but then again reminder that this is early access and you know development is still in progress on this so we may just have to you know bite our tongues but so far the game is pretty good except for you know some crashes which a lot of people are getting including myself uh which i crashed completely and one of the fixes number one would be that you're running on a higher end system, uh, either a 30, uh, 30 series card or a 440 series card like myself. And one of the things that uh, I found out what we have to do is actually take our max FPS and put it down to 60. We don't want it to run past that. You can try it at 90 for a bit if you're getting the, the crashes, but you know, rebooting is always a pain. Uh, V-Sync, you want to keep off. But the main thing is putting your FPS at just a standard 60 and let it play like, like that. I mean, if you're on a higher system and you have a high refresh monitor, yeah, I know, I get it. You want to run it at the at the max. Unfortunately, there are uh, you know problems right now with the game that is going to have you crash. Now, this will work on both the Xbox Game Pass version and on the uh, the Steam version. And now we'll just go into a, a, a few things here because this should fix most of your issues even the access violations but if you go on to your steam or other account you want to verify your game files so to verify your game files on steam you just want to go ahead right click go down to properties you should be able to see installed files once you go to the installed files you can click on the verified Verify integrity of game files. It'll take a few minutes depending on your CPU and you should be uh, good to go. Now the other, way, the other one for Game Pass is if you go to the game itself and then click on the three dots here, manage, and then you wanna go to files, verify and repair. Now those should fix other errors. The first one with the uh, FPS, you want to do that if you're completely crashing. The access violation ones, sometimes this will actually help you. Now the other things are that I've been seeing is that you can disable your multiplayer access. And that means that you'll only be able to connect to dedicated servers and you only can do co-op. Now the next thing you wanna do is make sure that you're using the latest graphics driver. If you're on NVIDIA, you wanna go ahead and right click, go to your GeForce experience. It should bring up all your stuff here. Click on your drivers and just make sure you're up to date on drivers. Now, if you're having problems still after the other two and you have the latest driver, you may want to reinstall your driver by clicking there and then you want to maybe even roll back your driver. Uh, depends on the card you're on, the system you're on, it's not gonna be the same for everybody. And you wanna also make sure that you're running this, the system requirements. I understand that a lot of times you can play a game uh, just fine on one game and be you know a little bit below the system requirements and it's just fine But remember when they put out those system requirements what they're doing is they're stress testing all these different systems and Not all of them are, are you know crashing on them So when it, there is one that's you know crashing they can't figure out the issue for it It's gonna it's gonna crash. They don't put it into the you know recommended or minimum list. So a lot of times it may be just fine for you know person A, and then for yourself, 
and it's it's crashing and it doesn't make any sense because it's the exact same system as other programs but it is still a different system so sometimes it's going to work sometimes it's not so then the last thing you want to do is just make sure that your windows is completely updated that you're running the latest version of windows and all your patches are added a lot of times especially if you're using the xbox game pass version because they are working directly with microsoft so if you if you're behind on your updates there is likely going to be some issues um, with the drivers everything else that is being installed so make sure you have everything up to date there and hopefully the devs will get some fixes on both the uh, game pass version and the steam version and everybody can you know play pal world and catch cute little pals anyway that's all we're gonna do for this video today make sure you hit that like button definitely subscribe if you're new to the channel y'all take care and happy gaming